This is the third part to the introduction to SOLIDWORKS Plastics videos. Previously I've shown you how to add parameters, run an analysis, and view and save your results. Now I will show you how to change your part configuration. Begin by going to Help and clicking on Settings. Then check the box that says SOLIDWORKS Configuration Integration if it is not already checked, and then click OK. Then go to your Configuration Manager. Double-click on the second configuration, and then choose Yes. Go back to your Plastics Manager, and mesh the second configuration by right-clicking on Shell, and then clicking Auto. As you can see, the parameters have not transferred over. To transfer the parameters, go back into your Configuration Manager and double-click on the default configuration, and then choose Yes. Go to the Model Manager and browse to find the part. Once you have found your part, click OK. Right-click on the default configuration and choose Copy Parameter. Then, right-click on your second configuration and choose Paste Parameter. Then click OK. Then go to the Configuration Manager and double-click on the second configuration. Then click Yes. Exit out of Model Manager. Go back to the Plastics Manager. Right-click on Gate Selection and then open settings. Place a gate on the back of the part. Click the add gate button and then click OK. Right click on flow and choose run. This will run your analysis. Take the box that says air traps, and as you can see, there are fewer air traps as compared to the previous model. I hope you have found this video helpful.